Hello and welcome everyone. Today in this video, I want us to know exactly how we can be able to uh, cut out a passport size photo in Adobe Photoshop 2020. This is Photoshop 2020. It's actually the same Photoshop that can be 2021 or also earlier versions a little like 2019 or all CC versions of adobe photoshop they're almost alike so we're going to start straight away what we're going to do straight you go to i know you know this this is a interface and the current photoshop shows you the most recent projects you're working on so you're going to say open and open the photo which photo do you want to work on and uh, now it comes out so there are many steps we need to learn uh, you have to watch this video up to the end it's not just about cropping out the passport we also need to remove the background uh, color so what are we going to do the first step is to remove the background color or the background of the photo so you have to use what we call the pen tool this feature is very important you need really to get used to it's going to help you to do a lot so you're going to right click and click on pen tool then you zoom for you to zoom you can alt then scroll up and down it keeps zooming in and zooming out now let us start selecting the area we need so you can zoom then keep moving through this then you can start from here i'm going to speed this a little bit Well, when you finish this part, you have to pass behind the, the layer and you pass just like, then you come and connect from where it started from, like in this area here, you click that. So once that is done, you can right click in the middle of where your selection is, then you say make selection. Or after you make selection, you just say, okay, don't change anything here. You see it, selects it. Or you can also come to this and say, make selection and say okay it's actually the same thing now what you need to select is which color do you want put on the background uh is it white or it is red so if it is red you can say red or if it's white you can say white remember this is a background lay background color and this is a foreground color but we're going to use a background color for our passports so let me choose let me use white now for you to remove it what you're going to do uh you're just going to control backspace so if you control backspace or control delete it's actually the same thing so you click and it moves out the background so that is the first step we're going to learn now step two we want to crop it out and make it a, a passport size photos in like in a four of them in a format so now you're going to say crop now on cropping make sure they select this ratio should be 3.5 by 4.5 that's the standard size for a passport others can use inches that is one a 1.5 by 2 so but if you select using centimeters you have to use 3.5 by 4.5 so make sure you center this properly then you say okay by clicking on this then you go to image size you click on image and image size then this also make sure it's centimeters and you select with it and you put 3.5 height should come automatic so then a uh, resolution you can use 200 or 300 it's not really bad so you find this is your passport now the next step is we're going to do uh set it for printing for example like four passports how are we going to do that so first of all you have to save this to your computer you go and save us save on your pc and you can select so you just want to put on the desktop and give it an appropriate name you want so i can give mine as passport two then i say okay and you can put it as maximum if whatever it's okay so then you say okay now from here your passport has been saved on the desktop it's actually this is the passport now what we're going to do is go to your back to your photoshop and say file new and one good thing with the current photoshop 2020 and beyond and 2019 all have these features you choose what you're doing if it is print 
photo and whatever so like for me it has between print photo and the rest so i want photo what which one am i going to select so i need four by six this is landscape this is portrait you can be printing it on there maybe eight by ten may, may like printing passports on four by six so i can select this or let me use landscape when i select landscape i say create now this has been created this is four by six and now this is your passport there are two ways you can carry it here if you had saved it before you can minimize and carry it and bring it here and place it there or you can as well come and pick this one so what you're going to do is alt and click and drag so when you drag keep dragging until you reach where the your layer is and click there you drop it there so you see this is your passport you can as well alt and drag it down to make a copy and now you can select all these two layers and uh, how you select all these two layers make sure you click shift then click on keep on clicking all that you need to to select now after that you can alt and drag it aside keep the same thing you can again alt or you can move a little bit by pressing these arrows and also you can again click and drag until you finish the paper size you want to print you can align them there are many ways you can align you can highlight all of them then come and align them using this or see this can align can also align so that is what you're going to do in making your passport size photo next video i'm going to show you how to make a photo really shine and bright in adobe photoshop so you need to subscribe and if you miss out it's going to be not very good for you so you have to select and you subscribe you'll be able to get the best of this video thank you very much for watching